My inbox exploded with one question, Notability or Good Notes? <laughs> Two apps that own iPad note taking. But here's the pot twist. One completely torched their reputation in 2021, and the other keeps making you rebuy new versions. <laughs> this is some weapons grade chaos in digital stationery. Both started as premium one-time purchases. Both were beloved by students. Then capitalism entered with subscriptions, creating a masterclass in user rage. Notability's 2021 meltdown was legendary. You bought the app for $9, used it for years, then suddenly they announced your purchase features would expire unless you paid 20 bucks annually. Not new features, stuff you already owned. Appalled. Reddit exploded. Apple stepped in because this violated App Store rules. Notability backtracked faster than a politician during elections. They kept subscriptions for new users though. Now there's this bizarre two-tier system where pre-November 2021 buyers get lifetime access, but everyone else gets subscription hell. This is interdimensional level business strategy. GoodNotes took a different wallet extraction approach. Instead of subscriptions, they release new versions every few years and make you rebuy everything. GoodNotes 5 users had to repurchase for GoodNotes 6. It's like buying a car then being told next year's model requires another purchase because they added cup holders. Current pricing gets spicy. Notability charges 20 bucks yearly. GoodNotes offers 12 bucks annually or 36 bucks one time. The math is fascinating. With Notability, you're paying $40 over two years. With GoodNotes, you could own it forever for 36 bucks. Feature-wise, both are criminally good. GoodNotes is the maximalist choice. Unlimited folders, custom templates, collaboration tools, flashcards, it's the Swiss army knife of note-taking. Notability takes the minimalist approach with cleaner interface and superior handwriting feel. Platform availability reveals everything. GoodNotes works everywhere. iPad, iPhone, Mac, Windows, Android, Web. Notability, just Apple devices. <laughs> In 2025, ecosystem lock-in feels deliberately limiting. Notability's subscription gatekeeping is aggressive. Want handwritten text search? Subscription. Custom colors? Subscription. iCloud backup? Subscription. <laughs> GoodNotes gives you three free notebooks, limiting but functional. My verdict, GoodNotes wins on value and features. But if you prioritize pure handwriting experience on iPad, Notability edges ahead despite the subscription robbery. Business users and power organizers, GoodNotes without question. Casual note takers wanting maximum value, GoodNotes one-time purchase. If this saved you from subscription regret, perfect. I investigate productivity apps that promise digital paradise and deliver <laughs> organized chaos.